One thing you can go and practice when you're either at the club or at your own place, you can take a white line like this, just string it out, or if you got a if you're at the polo club and they got the back line already uh, chalked out, use that. Put a ball on the back line. And this is just uh, a lot of people when they approach the line from the near side, it's uh, a lot of people just go for the ball. You need to go to the line and then straighten up with the line and then go make your play, whether it's a backhand or forward near side shot. So I'm going to demonstrate right now, if you're slightly off the line, what to do on the defensive play and then what to do if you make an offensive play. All right, so let's just say uh, the red player hit the ball from over there to there. So that's pretty much the line of the ball. I'm over here and I need to make a defensive play. I'm quite a little ways ahead of the player. So pretty much all I can do is play the near side back. So what you want to do, instead of going straight to the ball and playing the back right there, you'll see it's hard to straighten up with the line and not go over. So you can be fouling pretty much every time you do that. Ball's hit from there, it's going down the line. Go to the line, straighten up with the line, get lined up, and play your backhand. You'll notice as I play the backhand, my horse doesn't go over the line. Continue in a straight line, don't go over the line. So that's a defensive play. The quicker you get to that line and the quicker you get straight, the less chance you got to cross over as you play your shot. So get to that line, get straight, and play the shot. Now the offensive play. All right, once again, my team's going that way right now. My number three hit a pass app, not right on my mallet. What do we expect? But now what do we do to get that ball without fouling? Let's say my blue player hit it up there. A red player jumped on the line. He's coming on the line now. So I can't go in there and take it on my offside. I have to take it on my near side. So what do we do? Once again, it's just like the near side back end. Go to the line as quick as you can, straighten up, play a little neck shot, and now put the ball on my mallet side and I'm, I got it on the easy side. A lot of guys try and go in there and keep hitting it straight on the near side. Make it easy, just place the ball to your right and then hit it off side. So these are kind of plays you can practice. If you got any kind of white line, just place it on the line, Come from an angle, go to the line, straighten up, either play your backhand or your little forehand, forehand little neck shot, and then that just gives you an idea how to get onto the line from the near side. Not always just going straight to the ball, but to the line, straighten up, and then you play your shot.